What? You have that many questions? I just want to see how the ring light makes me look. It's live. Oh, Bitcoin to the moon. <laughs> uh huh. I don't look as tired, but you can still see my zit. You got 14 people watching you. <laughs> I don't care. 15. None of these people know me. Hmm. Uh, hello. Live question and answer with Laura. No, nobody wants that. You shouldn't be on. Yeah, I was bored. There's nothing else to do right now. That's rude. Fuck you. What? <laughs> Yeah, you go do your homework. Um, yeah, no, I uh, not taking timestamps. We're not gonna save this one to post to the channel, um, so it's gonna be very uh, random. In uh, uh, random, uh, I don't know, less less formal. So the only people that get to see this are the people that come in and hang out. So, yeah, we're not going to save this. Nobody's going to be able to watch this stuff later. I am recording it to my computer, though. Like, if we do get some decent content out of this, I don't know. Maybe we'll, uh, I can clip some of those and, like, post them throughout the week. So, maybe we'll see some of these throughout the week, depending on how, who all shows up, who all asks questions, whatever's going on, you know. But otherwise, I'm just kind of hanging out just chilling so what test should the bodybuilder take for kidneys uh cystatin c cystatin c <clears throat> here let me show you i get all my blood work done here at uh ulta lab tests everybody has their own favorite place but this is where i like to go so what i would do is i would look up Cis, whoops, I can't type. This, <laughs> this, there we go. It just pops up. Cystatin C, and this is the one. Cystatin C with EGFR, forty bucks. That's all you need. Boom. Add that to cart. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing this anyway, sometime soon. Shit. You know what? I could just show you guys what I'm gonna order then. How about that? Here, let's, uh, let's shrink this down, so you can see that pretty little face <laughs> um yeah sure let's do this so we're gonna get a cystatin c test already put that in right no agent i don't need your fucking help um let's see then we go what cmp <clears throat> uh yep comprehensive metabolic panel both of these are 19 find basically the exact same thing let's just add that to the cart cool um, and then we want CBC complete blood count with platelets very nice very nice okay uh, and then let's see we want um, what do we want? We want, uh... No, Mike, you can't rewatch this video. <laughs> this video is not being saved to the channel. Like, this is it. This is live. It's live and then it's gone. Um, let's see, what else? CMP? I already did that. No, no, I didn't. Yeah, I already did that. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> um, let's see, I already put cystatin C in. Uh, we need testosterone. Free and total. Boom. Free and total and sex hormone binding globulin. That would probably be smart to keep that uh, in the mix as well. Go ahead and add that to cart. Uh, and then we want uh, estradiol. Mm hmm. Oh, well, I guess right there. That's fine. Doesn't matter. You see, guys, like you can find 
these mixed with so many different freaking things. It's just like I wish that there was just one deal that you could like click on that would give you all of these mixed together, but it just doesn't work that way. Uh, somebody says lipids. I believe lipids are included in CMP. Maybe no, maybe maybe I'm thinking about uh, kidney stuff. But you can see what is uh, what's in these by clicking and looking. Oh, this is liver and kidneys. Yeah, lipids aren't in this. So yeah, I need to do lipids. <sighs> Lipid panel with ratios. You know, I've never done the uh, the LDL like the special looking at the the. Is that this one? Where it shows more, oh, maybe I should do that this time, because I've never actually looked to see what what my LDLs, like all the different ones, are, you know. Hmm. I think that would be smart to at least do once, you know. I mean, the male hormone panel, though, it'll throw in things that I don't want. You know, that's what I'm saying. Um, so, let's see. Uh, we want... Uh, what do we want? What do we want? We want C-reactive protein. This is inflammation marker. Um, we want prostate, so PSA. There we go. Add that. Um, we want IGF-1. Hmm. It's probably space. Whoops, whoops, whoops. There we go. IGF-1. Oh, the Z-score. I don't care about the Z-score, but whatever. Um, hmm. What am I missing? I feel like I'm missing something. Um, should we get homocysteine? I, I, I never have worried about that. Um, let me see, what else? Uh, CMP includes, includes, uh, let's see, it includes glucose, but it doesn't, oh, um, we need the insulin, um, what's it called? Uh, A1C, that's not in here. Yes, hemoglobin A1C. All right, what else? I feel like I'm missing something. Joe, you were diagnosed with kidney disease. Joe, you're... You're you're the you're the guy I met at uh uh right ah oh. we were trying to figure out for a while what was wrong with you right how did they yeah okay I remember yeah it's been a while dude um how did they come up with it being your kidneys. Yeah, you were having crazy, uh, crazy issues and couldn't figure out what the hell was going on. Just a straight up biopsy. 
But had I mean, hadn't you gotten? Uh, yeah, your water retention was ridiculous. I, I don't. I mean, I thought. Didn't we? Didn't you have your creatinine checked and cystatin C? What was your What was your eGFR? Joe was having like serious water retention issues, just from like super small changes in his uh, in his like testosterone dosage. See, see, see that that's scary. Um, eGFR was ninety five. Yeah, that's why we were kind of like, well, wow, man. EGFR was 95. Was that was that for creatinine? Or cystatin C? Or creatinine? Protein urea was really bad. I have a high EGFR and get water all the time. That is interesting. Um, let's see, what else? What else? I don't think, I think that's it. For blood tests. Yeah, your creatinine was a one. That's weird. Did you, did you get a, yeah, so your creatinine wasn't even showing, showing anything at all. That's nuts. Did you ever end up getting a cystatin C test? Yeah, the protein in the urine is what gave a clue. I mean, it's true, like, the, the blood work is, is just there to kind of help give you an idea, but it's not the end-all, be-all, you know? I mean, especially, like... Especially, like, Joe, his deal was, uh, like, he was having, like, really bad, like, water, like, like, water balloon issues, you know? Like, he was, he, he was having, like, serious edema problems. Can't, can't, uh, Wraith, just do a screenshot, dude. Here. Here, if everybody wants to know what to get, screenshot it. Screenshot it now. Yeah, I mean, this is this is what I'm gonna be buying. You good? Everybody, screenshot that. Got it. Got it. Got it. Wraith? And if you're on a computer, all you gotta do is hold control, print screen, then go to uh, go to your paint app and paste it in there. Cool. Okay. But yeah guys, I mean this is this is what I'm gonna be ordering for my next blood test. So, get that off of here. Um, I still have water retention issues doing 60 milligrams less Sinopril per day in 25 for water retention. No more gear. Yeah, man. Crazy. That's crazy. When you say... So this is a this is another thing, a lot of people don't realize. Like when you say foamy urine, like how 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 many bubbles are we talking here? Are we talking like bubbles like building up so much that it like comes almost out of the top of the toilet, or um, or just like a couple bubbles floating around a little bit? <laughs> A lot of people don't don't notice that as anything. I've also heard um, sugar in your urine can uh, cause that. Flush several times to get. Oh wow.
flush several times to get it all down. Well, okay, that I mean that that means it's a lot. <laughs> That's a lot. <clears throat> that would be uh, that would be interesting to um, to do like a video on. Um, yeah, Mike, uh, Joe was, uh, I don't know, he, he was using, uh, a Lotus trend for a while, but I, I don't know. I mean, he had been on for a very long time off and on. Yeah, like he's, he, he's been using for probably as long as I have, I think, if I remember right. But I, I don't know if you could just point it at one thing to be completely honest. Tippy Toes says blood sugar. Um, blood sugar will be uh, with my... If you want to contact me for info so you can share it to your subscribers, I'm cool with that. It's crazy, man. Um, yeah, maybe that would be that would be something worth uh, worth doing. No, I mean it, it's cool. Like we're, like I said, um, this 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 uh, video is not going. Uh, I'm not saving this one to the channel. So like if if like once this is over, it's being deleted. Like it's just it's done. So you know, if if people don't stick around, they're not gonna see <laughs> they're not gonna see anything. Um, can't come back and watch this one later. So. Um, yeah, that's nuts, dude. Um, yeah, we were trying to figure that out. We were going back and forth for a while on that, trying to figure out what the hell the problem was. And what sucked was the blood work wasn't even uh, the blood work wasn't even showing anything. But I don't know. I'd be something I think a lot of guys don't realize, especially about like the the, the foamy urine thing can be a huge um, indicator. That a lot of guys just kind of, uh, you know, brush off. Um, I mean, it would be, I think it would be worth, like, if you still have that and it's still, like, going like that, I mean, it would be, um, it would be worth uh, taking a picture and being like, this is not, this is what it looks like, you know? Um, wow, five grams per day. Interesting. Was that... How did they check that? How how did they... Ch was that through... Because I know you can, like, do those little, like, piss tests at home. I think you can... Or can't... I don't know. It depends on how you... How they did it. Normal maximum is 200 milligrams. Oh, wow. And you had five... Five grams. Um... pee in a container. Oh, so you just put all your pee in, in a container and then it checks it through that. So you pee in a container all day and then what? Do you take it, do you take it to the hospital or you know, do you take it to your piece? Yeah, you do. Okay. <clears throat> and then they check it. Very interesting. Take it back to the lab. Want to buy Joe's piss for gains? <laughs> um, somebody said something I missed. Hello, new here. Why not save this live? Uh, because it's Saturday. <laughs> um, I do lives like you're new here. I do lives uh, Monday through Friday at 4 p.m. typically. And today I was just bored, so I figured I'd hop on and see what's going on with everybody. So this is not being saved to the channel. I'm not taking timestamps. I'm not doing any of that. It's more of just a casual chatting, hanging out. And right now we are learning from Joe um, about his stage two kidney disease. What time zone? Uh, Central Standard Time, C CST. I'm in Chicago. Um, Joe, um, oh, what was I going to ask? Uh, 
Shit, what was I going to say? Um, you're doing that. Are you using... You were at stage two, but EGFR wasn't showing anything. That's crazy. Are... are hmm. Don't you have to claim it to be natural? Um, are you using any astragalus at all? I mean, is there anything else that the doctors have told you? Yeah. Is there anything the doctor, any other things they, they have you taking outside of the lisinopril? Um, how was your blood pressure? I, I forget. What was your blood pressure like? It was, it was okay, wasn't it? I, I don't remember. Low ferritin, but high hematocrit. Woo! Um, not supposed to take anything but the lisinopril, aldactone, and fish oil. That's nuts, dude. Um... Did, did you... Blood pressure was in the upper 140s. Okay. Um, did... Did they... I don't know. Did they even, like, talk about other, like, uh, blood pressure medication alternatives? Uh, because there are some other, like, ARBs that are better for kidney health. Um, like... For example, like Fuad Abiyad, his uh, he specifically takes Azelsartan, the the ARB blood pressure medication, because it helps uh, kidneys. I don't know that that might be something worth asking about if they didn't if they didn't say anything about that. But that's uh, that's crazy. It's crazy that you that like your GFR, like your your creatinine was fine, your cystatin C was fine. It wasn't showing anything um, through those. I don't know. What else are other people saying? Doctor recommended lisinopril because it also helps with protein in the urine. The ACE inhibitor also helps block aldosterone. Well, I guess that's a good reason. Joe, what about your urinating strength? Did the stream get weak? The stream was fine. Huh. Uh, 